girl, Sapphire Glow. If you're seeing this beautiful face for the first time, I'm Sophia. I do videos around lifestyle, reaction, fashion, cooking, and uh, everything in between. So if you're interested in seeing what my channel is up to, you can just scroll down to the previous videos that I've made and um, watch anyone that catches your fancy. And please, guys, don't you forget to subscribe to join this amazing family. Yeah. It will be really, really, really appreciated by you. Thank you once more. So, guys, without wasting much of your time, I'm just going to tell you about this video today. It's all about, but as it's time to suggest, I know a lot of you would have known what this video is going to be about. Yeah. Today's video, we're going to be talking about the places, I mean, the places that Nigerian passport. So, if you're in Nigeria and you passport holder of the Nigerian um, green passport, yeah. There are so many countries that we can visit. A lot of people don't know about this, but I would just like to share those um, countries with us that our Nigerian passport can take us to. A lot of people don't know about it, like I said, but we have like 54 countries that our Nigerian passport can take us to. So if you're right there in Nigeria and um, you're getting tired, because right now the country is frustrating a lot of people, things are not working, things are not moving, a lot of people, a lot of the youths are just planning to leave that country so guys if you are one of those people that would like to visit and you're finding it difficult to get visas to um, the western world and uh, you have no problem now that i'm going to like show you the countries and um, list of the countries that our nigerian passport can take us into it's 54 countries all together that this nigerian green passport can take us into so guys um so if you like i said so now that we're going to have an idea of where our passport can take us out um, to you don't need to get frustrated you don't need to get ang angry you, you just have to be happy about those places that our visas that our passport can take us to and you know most of these countries some of these countries you can access without visas some you can access when you get to the airport or the border you have to pay for the visa and um, some have limited time that you can come into the country and you have to go out then if you want to come back in again it's your problem but you have um, um limited time that you can stay in this um in some of this country not all in some of this country and while um, the other ones you can they, they have no restriction you just go and stay as long as you want so some of these countries are so beautiful you know i've been to a few of those countries and i really enjoyed my stay there when i went to i'm just going to be listing them and putting them up on the screen for you guys to see the places that our passport so we can just say that our passport is it's not it's not that useless like we all think you know that it can take you anyway but it can it sure can take you to some um, great destinations that you can have uh, adventures with um with uh, fun places that you can have adventures they have great beaches they have um, um great um, um sightseeing places that you can go to and enjoy do you understand and um, all you need i think all you need when you um when you must have chosen the country that you want to go to make out your plans get your budget ready you know make out um, um, plans and all that to get your itineraries and um, I know you don't forget that you you also would be needing your, your passport to be valid for six months minimum of six months you have to have a valid passport for six months and you have to go with some passport size photograph because I know most of these countries would need your passport you know photograph so don't forget to go with your passport photograph and valid passport for that is at least you know valid for six months and um, um, which of course your visa fee because um, some of these countries you will have to pay your visa fee at the point of um, entry and uh, some at the border so don't forget about these three uh, most important things and then you can just go and enjoy yourself so now that um, we all know that our passports have some um, some value <laughs> let me just say it has some value now you can just um, don't get yourself stressed up um, if you cannot get a um, visa to the Western world, enjoy yourself, go to these places, you know, just get your, your tickets, get your itinerary ready, um, your hotels and all that, book for a tour and just go have amazing time in um, these countries. So I'm just going to leave these countries up on the screen so that you know and have an idea and then start getting yourself 
prepared maybe after the pandemic you you know after the pandemic or if you still want to go the only thing is that you get quarantine when you get to those some of those countries i guess so guys so i'm just gonna leave it up here for you to see and um yeah jet planes in the night sky with you Getting high in the sunrise with you Getting through all the bad times with you I wasn't missing a thing, no I do And I wish that I could do this energy Cause I moved on So guys, you can see that you don't need to worry about needing a visa to these countries. So now that you have an idea, now that you know, why don't you just start planning your project, you know, center plan a journey, center around your project to go have an amazing and adventurous time in those countries. You won't regret it. So guys, thank you for staying to the end of this video and I hope you enjoy every bit of this video and um, don't forget to leave a comment as usual and Lorette Sapphire Glow is going to see you at the next video for now, it's goodbye and God bless you, bye all. Well.